hope you had a great day yesterday. It's Friday here, and probably Friday where you're at too, I'm sure. <laughs> uh, but uh, excited for the weekend, excited for the church services uh, this weekend as well. And then Monday, our young people head to Camp CBM Prayer uh, for them. I want to draw your attention to Psalm 23 as we continue to walk through uh, uh, really word by word this psalm. Psalm 23 tells us in verse 1, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside still waters. And so we get to verse number 3. Just wanted to run over this, this clause with you. The Bible says, He restoreth my soul. You know, what does it mean uh, to restore? It means to, to bring back uh, better, uh, to, uh, uh, to fix up, to repair. And that's what the Lord uh, does to us. When we, uh, when we make mistakes, uh, the Lord is there waiting to restore us back to himself. Uh, and we find, and, and David's the writer of the psalm, and we find in uh, many of the other psalms, and, and, and uh, in a lot of them, where David asks for the Lord to renew him, uh, to create in him a right spirit, uh, and, we, and we find that actually throughout Scripture, individuals uh, uh, asking the Lord uh, to, to be with them, to guide them, uh, to renew them, to restore them. Uh, we find in Isaiah 40, verse 31, familiar verse, but they that wait on the Lord uh, shall renew their strength, they shall model with the wings as eagles, uh, and so on. Uh, but you have that renewal aspect of things. And that's what the restoring is talking about uh, here, renewing, uh, restoring. Uh, and and the Lord wants to renew us, and and I'm glad that I'm thankful that His mercies are new uh, every morning. And so I want to encourage you today: uh, rejoice in the fact that the Lord restores our soul. Uh, he He helps us uh, to get to where we need to be, uh, and helps us to get back to where we have been, maybe even. And that's what uh, we see here. He restoreth my soul uh, and uh, as a shepherd uh, guides his sheep you know a, a, a sheep wanders off wanders off path the shepherd brings that sheep back into the fold and that's what the Lord does with us and so no matter what you've gone through no matter the mistakes maybe that you've made hey let's come back to the Lord knowing that the Lord will restore our soul he'll restore a right spirit within us so let's not keep running from him uh, and, and this almost speaks to uh, a thought of revival uh, as, as we think of a, maybe a, a returning to or a coming back to the Lord. Hey, don't be afraid. Uh, I, I know sometimes we, we get this mindset of, oh, I can't, I can't go back. Man, what are people going to think? Who cares what people think? You need to be restored back to the Lord. You need to experience that renewal, that revival uh, in your heart, in your spirit. And so let's, let's get back to our relationship with the Lord. If you've fallen away, hey, come back to Him. The Lord is the one that restores. Uh, and and, and maybe, maybe you, you haven't left Him, but maybe you're just a little discouraged. Hey, uh, leave everything in the Lord's hands and allow Him to restore your soul. Uh, this kind of speaks to what uh, we think, I think of the uh, the passage of scripture as we think about uh, restoring and, and renewing it reminds me kind of, of of the Lord when he gives that that peace that passeth all understanding uh, how that even in the midst of uh, some troublesome days uh, and difficult times the Lord restores our soul and 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 the difficulty may still be there but you have that peace uh, and so allow the Lord to restore you today. Get into his word, worship him today, uh, and then uh, live for him uh, today. Well, I just want to leave you with that thought today. Uh, have a restored soul, uh, a renewed spirit, uh, and uh, allow the God to do a great work in your life. Let's live for him. Well, have a great day. Have a blessed weekend, and I hope to see you uh, in church Sunday. I hope to see you there for Sunday school. Uh, if you can make it, and then also our uh, uh, evening service as well. All right, Lord bless you. Have a great day. Have a great weekend.